on a real time scenario right like we have some use case use cases how they deployed this sdn for some of the clients now why they went for sdn what was the challenges they faced faced so this will give you an idea when you go to the customer for example when you go to customer and uh, he is saying that i have one two three challenges then you will be able to think of a solution you can tell okay, this problem could be solved by having this technology so you need to see some kind of use cases we will talk about that and then we will talk about the product features and then we will talk about integration and we call in sdn there is something called overlay and underlay okay uh, this big switch works as a underlay you know and overlay you will have other things like newtonics vm where open stack all of them will be as a working on a uh, overlay so we'll talk about how you can integrate those technologies those hyperconvergence those uh, you know virtualization concept over um, you know big switch then we will talk about some design consideration and question answers so this is what today we'll try to cover in today's session before we start you know do you, are you clear with agenda what you are going to learn today and if you have any doubts please ask me before we get into that uh, session you are, i want to make sure that your expectation are set right so when we start the session uh, everybody is on the same page and we can uh, inshallah uh, get the outcome at the end of the session do you have any questions in from the audience from uh, attending on webex yeah someone wants to ask fine yeah mohammed uh, i want to ask this this product yeah. is more competitive with uh, aci or or is it Great. something different like okay fine so uh cisco is is asking about how this is you know competitive with cisco and other brand so cisco is very specific to cisco right but this one is open networking so you can use any switch any hardware any appliance which support open networking platform and big switch is only su uh, supplying the software which is the brain of the sdn okay so you can use dell you can use hp switches so any platform which support open networking you can buy that we call that as a white box concept okay it doesn't have any brain you use your controller to control uh, so this uh, big switch is becoming more popular especially in isps and big uh, deployment like facebook google uh, uh, amazon uh, azure you know wherever they have cloud infrastructure this becomes Uh, very popular because it it works with all this open standard networking. Uh, when we talk about Cisco, it's very specific to uh, Cisco product. You have to buy a specific uh, uh, you know product series like 9K, 7K. You know the, only this works, right? So that's where it differs. I think um, when we get into more, uh, I know, when, when I talk about this, in, I'll cover this in the slide as well. But to answer you. and this is much more open than cisco nice thank you welcome any other questions i want to be make interactive so that you don't you 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 know you understand it you are just not just running towards slides um, so if you have any questions please uh, you can type on the chat box and then i can pass and answer you great so let us get into the subject so now nowadays you know that data centers are transforming towards software defined data centers earlier we used to have uh, you know racks of servers uh, loads of switches you know cables going across here and there and you know going and connecting with your with your console trying to manage but now the entire concept of uh, data center is changing uh, and and everybody is moving to, towards software defined data centers 
so that's what the core subject core topic will be talking about uh, today so then you at the end of the session you know what is sddc at least you know that definition of sddc in some okay. so the main advantage of sddc is you can run cloud native applications and also you can support business demands uh, and also the other thing is the cost optimization so it is automated it's more of logical and you can scale out today if you go to amazon or uh, azure in a cloud and you are talking about you started with the small service right you you had let us say uh, 5 uh, gb ram maybe 20 gb uh, hard disk and you want this is the cpu power this is the bandwidth but the moment you feel that i need to increase my capacity i my business is growing then you can go and say you know please increase my capacity so it's just a click of a button you can upgrade without worrying about i need to buy a new hardware i need to call the isp and increase the bandwidth no hassle that's what is happening with this uh, sddc you will be able to scale out and you can bring in new services and what is the underlying part of it there are three main component which is uh, very important for all sddc the first one is compute compute is about your processing power it's like a hash power am i right how much uh, you can process the second one is the network which can uh, handle the traffic the third one is the storage how you can store your data so these three elements are very important and that's where today the concept of hyper converged infrastructure hci we call it be it nutanix be it uh, vmware you know be it cisco hyperflux you know big hp everyone is uh, are, are dell dxri so all of them are pushing this technology called hyper converged infrastructure where they have compute network storage as one device previously i used to go on and uh, say that okay give me a quotation for storage you say it is 10 terabyte this is the bill so you they will bring you some device you put in the data center then i say how do i connect okay buy a storage switch am i right so you ask the vendor couple of vendors comes and sell you sell you a storage switch okay then you install the storage switch on the top of the rack connect the storage then you ask okay i don't have a processing power what should i do you go and buy blade server hp blade ibm blade all right it's like a chassis so you buy them so now you have a rack of servers and a rack of storage uh, storage switches and network switches everything is different silos different domain and you have different department to manage and all these things are used for what all these things are used for what at the end of the day you will be running your application service is something which is will be running on all this you know underlay right you may running erp software you may run a, you know website you may run a business application your oracle your program whatever you call it all this application is run so at the end of the day what is all this technologies all this concept is to meet my business requirement am i right so today everyone looks for what is the time to market i want to launch service i know that at this large want to launch some services they would like to do that within maybe 2 months 3 months time because that's the time they have before that they have to capture the market imagine they have to roll out such a big project for application new application you know let's say it is not uh, do or even for example arnak you know and you are going to get a quotation start processing your hardware vendor software vendor network vendor imagine the time it's going to take maybe project they want to complete in 3 months you will get the quotation after 2 months all right so product will be delivered after another 8 to 10 weeks so it's very difficult to manage uh, the business demand is growing and if you are not agile if you are not uh, you know scalable if you are not able to uh, fulfill the business requirement on time they are then you are out of the business somebody else will come and capture them all these things they made it club together and they run out on hci you know 
platform and this entire infrastructure is again uh, how do you program how do you make sure everything is runs you use a software defined data lgn concept okay on top of it you run all this application we are talking about be it your active directory be it oracle you know xyz 